Hi, my name is Andy with Conifer Kingdom. We offer over 2,000 varieties of dwarf conifers, Japanese maples, ginkgos, and other trees. Today we're going to focus on dwarf conifers and the exciting process behind introducing new varieties. Dwarf conifers are a specific slow-growing subset of conifer trees. Conifers are cone-bearing trees. These include spruce, pines, firs, and many more. Dwarf conifers can generally be classified as any variety that grows slower than a species naturally would. Specifically, dwarf conifers are genetic mutations of faster growing non-dwarf varieties. I'll explain this more later. Where is a good place to plant a dwarf conifer? Anywhere, really. They are a great option for container gardens, railroad gardens, and even bonsai. They grow in many different climates and almost every region of the U.S. has some type of native conifer with unique dwarf variations. Why are dwarf conifers great for the landscape? Conifers are commonly thought of as evergreens, but some of the most interesting varieties are actually deciduous, losing all of their needles at the end of the fall. The term evergreen is not exclusive to conifers. There are other kinds of plants that are evergreen, including heathers, rhododendrons, and laurels, many of which make great companion plants for conifers. Conifers have fantastic four-season interest and display great color throughout the year. There is an unbelievable amount of variety in the color, shape, growth rate, and texture of conifers. It might take some time to sift through all the options, but you can find a conifer that is a perfect fit for any spot. Another reason to grow conifers is that they aren't picky. As long as the tree is hardy to your USDA zone, conifers take almost no maintenance once they are established. They can be pruned to keep them in the shape you want, but the biggest requirement is that they have well-draining soil. I mentioned earlier that dwarf conifers are genetic mutations. It's not as freaky as it sounds. Many cultivated varieties are found as unique seedling selections, but others can be derived from naturally occurring mutations in other trees. These mutations are commonly known as witches' brooms. These unique plants can be propagated by grafting to replicate them and introduce them to collectors. It is a form of propagation known as clonal propagation, where the final product inherits the unique attributes of the original broom or seedling. You can learn more about witches' brooms on our blog. Now that you know all about dwarf conifers, check out our website to see the rare varieties we have to offer, www.conifercingdom.com. Have questions about conifers we didn't answer in this video? Send us an email, info at conifercingdom.com. Follow us on Facebook, Pinterest, Twitter, and Instagram to get the latest updates and photos and news.